Now the News 8 Backlot, presented by San Diego County Credit Union. Welcome back to News 8 Morning Extra. This jacket I am wearing right now, big, right? Actually, it's a men's size 6X. And my next guest used to wear this jacket all the time until he lost all of this weight. I want to introduce you to Randy. First of all, Randy Sherman, good morning. Good morning. This, you said, was even just a tad too big for you. I was only 5X. You were a 5X at the time. <laughs> uh, if you don't mind sharing, Randy, how much did you weigh when you were at your heaviest? 374 and a half. 374 and, and a half. half. Wow. And did you have an epiphany one day that I just can't do this anymore? Got tired of people calling me fat and stuff like that. So I just said, my mom was a TOPS member and I, I decided to join. And then uh, the whole year, I only had one weight gain. I lost all, all the whole year, to down, right down to my weight, down to 230. So. So, so in one year, you lost how many pounds? 144 and a half. 144 pounds in a year. I didn't even know that was possible without some sort of surgery. Oh, it's just a lot of work, exercise, watching what you eat, eating normal. Okay, so let's go back to how you do this. You joined a group called TOPS. What's TOPS? Take off pounds sensibly. Take off pounds sensibly. It's a nationwide organization. Um, Randy, you're not a medical expert by any sense of the word. You're just someone who says this worked for me and I think it could work for you too. You got doctors, you got nurses in the club. You know, there's one thing about this rather than us, one counselor, you got everybody's a counselor. Everybody looks up stuff, everybody brings stuff to meetings, you have programs, you look through them, and it's a good way to learn how to eat better, and you know, just have one person that's never been through this, everybody's been through this, it's in our program. There's a lot of them all over San Diego, so if you don't like one, you can try another one. Wow. It's only, and it's only $32 a year. So this is an affordable way to yeah. lose weight, and you're kind of supporting each other along the way. What were some of the key changes you made that, that had the pounds melting off? Well, the biggest was this right here. That's why I brought it. I, 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 I probably ate a jar big, twice this size a week of mayonnaise. You were uh, a mayonnaise guy? 100 calories a piece. Oh, my goodness. This, this is only 10 calories. That's only 20 calories. So making dietary changes. Oh, tons of them. Okay, so this was one of the things. You switched your mayonnaise intake. This was your thing, apparently. Intakes probably might be the same, but the calories are uh, fourth of what they were, or fifth. Wow, okay, so you didn't necessarily have to cheat yourself out of anything you like. You just realized and started reading labels on what was actually better for you. What other changes did you make? Uh, just, uh, I, write down, I wrote down everything I ate. I counted every calorie every day. So I had a long journal of everything I ate. So every day I knew I stayed under about 1,500 calories and then eventually I was able to eat, stay under 2,000 calories and stay the weight. But wow. Now I can stay under 2,500 calories and keep the weight off. You mentioned you've had a number of hip surgeries, I've but I know six. this didn't come without exercise. Well, that's the reason, one of the reasons I gained the weight. Every time I have a hip operation, you know, I'm settled, settled down, I have to go through all these exercises. And I had one on my 50th birthday, I had a hip replacement. On my 52nd birthday, I had a hip replacement. Oh. Nice Christmas birthday present. No kidding. Anyway, I ended up with five on this side, one on this side, and a knee on that side. And that knee got infected. I had to go to convalescent. Got lymphedema. I have to wrap that at night. But I don't use a cane or a crutch anymore. I can walk without it. Do I, you wonder, Randy, what might have happened to you had you not lost all this weight? I probably wouldn't be here. Mm, that's powerful. No, it's real powerful. This club did a lot for me. Uh, just my mind got better too. You it know, sure I, did. You had just to sort of think of things. I a played bit sports all my life. You know, I pitched fast pitch softball in this town for 25 years. I bowl. I shot pool. I do all that stuff. Now the only thing I can do is golf. That's one of my exercises: golfing. You're out there and you're not using that golf cart. You're walking through the golf well, course. I use a golf cart, but I walk. The other guy drives, and I walk most of it. But Good. I still, I still ride a cart. Yeah, I, I can walk. Uh, you know, a mile or so, but the whole, I, I walked the course the other day when it was raining, but we couldn't take a well, car. good for you. I just want you to leave our viewers with one thing. Maybe somebody out there is struggling to lose weight. Maybe it's 10 pounds. Maybe it's 150 pounds. What can you tell people as far as just get started? What's, what can you advise for people out there? Well, I, uh, every, they have to really want to do it. They can't just say, well, I kind of want to do it. You have to get mad at yourself and want to do it. Start counting your calories. Uh, and paying attention to what you eat. You'd be surprised if you write it down and look at it at the end of the week. Oh, I didn't eat this, I didn't eat that, or this or that. Uh, it works good to write it down what you eat and count Baby the steps calories. To get that food journal yep. going. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have you put on this jacket All now, right. and then you're going to see at home exactly how small Randy is now compared to what he used to be. This is a men's size 6X. I'll forgive you that it's a Vikings jacket, but <laughs> that's a big difference, Randy. 
I got, I got it for ten dollars. So. For ten dollars, <laughs> and I don't think you're going to need that thing again. Nope. Not I'm, at I'm trying all. to find a Viking, any Viking out there that wants to buy it for a hundred bucks. <laughs> <laughs> now you're going to upsell it. <laughs> you're going to make money off this thing. Randy Sherman, again, the organization is called Tops. They've got a website. They've got a Facebook page. You can go there and find more information about the group. It's super affordable. Uh, Eric, I know you're a Viking yes, fan, I am. but. Um, you almost would be able to fit a couple of guys inside yeah, this jacket. Yeah, yeah, it's a little too big. Maybe we can That's rework it, too, turn it into a sweater or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Hey. I'm glad to see it hanging on him now. Exactly. He looks in great shape. And the Vikings are doing good this year, too. So uh, I'm glad to, to see. You able to make some money off that thing. Glad to see he's doing so well. Well, I've got to get mean at yourself, get angry with yourself sometimes to push yourself. I like that. That's the way to do it. Very inspirational. All right, thanks, guys.